Hello, Scrabble here, coming at you with more Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom on the Nintendo Switch. We're gonna switch our stuff back around to the night stuff. There we go. Okay, takes care of that guy. And yes, we can kill these guys too. I don't think there's a tremendous amount of point to it, but you can do it. Okay, so we use our new abilities to blast through these things. Ow. You know, I can use some hearts now. I was iffy before. Now I say give them to me. Uh, I don't like those guys. Okay. That did not go great for me. We are, of course, in the last dungeon. This is why the music is absolutely banging. And clearly, my choice of weapon... Okay, one, we can't be hit by the lasers. And clearly, my choice of weapon is not going to work against the Cyclops. I like the money, though. There you go. All right, I can do this. Ow. Anything up here? No. I noticed that there's a little spot there. You'll notice here that the back is covered with this glass stuff. That's actually going to be quite important. Okay. I wonder if I could just ice this guy. Let's check it out. Nope. Ice. There you go. Hmm. We can only hit him in the back. Fortunately, we've got the uh, the jump there. Okay. I kind of wish I had the ability to just easily cycle between equipment loadouts. You will also notice that we have this guy. So we want to go up because we need to stay behind the glass so that this thing with this town on it can't see us. Deadly important. Huh. I actually thought I was okay there. All right, I'm going to cut here and we'll come back there. All right, we're back to this part once again. There we go. Okay. Now we should be safe, I think. Yeah, so here we can't go forward this way because we've got this stuff there. We're gonna pop through. And we should have a save point near here. Uh, we got snake, we got lion. Let me see if I can make a teleport. I can't. Okay. So, I hope I don't die. I don't see if it auto-saved when I came in. We'll do snake first. 
So we have to go through these statues in order to unlock our forms. And fortunately, they are like these super cool, like, retroish challenges. I really love them. And back when I was posting just a ton of videos and pictures and stuff on my Twitter, I did not post any of these because I didn't want to spoil the experience for those who hadn't seen it yet. There we go. Nope. Hmm. This one, I think, is a little tough for me. Whoa. There we go. Hey, I think I did it. Take a little look at our little tiny 8-bit, uh... 8-bit blast there, which I enjoy. Hey, did you see that? Something's up with the gate. Let's hope it's a sign that Jin's doing fine in there. Ah, oh, and then we get this wonderful mouse man arrangement. Of course, it's gone now. All right, so on to Lion Man. Um. Lion Man does not get a double jump, apparently. I tried to double jump. There's no stamina thing here, I just noticed. That's what happened to me last time. Let's wait for our stamina to recover. Alright. This game. This game. Last time I did this, I actually don't remember having any trouble with this section. I remember it being pretty straightforward. And I got squished. FYI, getting squished is insta death. And there's lots of times when I don't think I should be squished, but the game thinks I should be squished. Took a sip of my coffee here. Hmm. Oh no! I did not realize there was a wall after me. Oh hey, there's a thing right there. There we go. That's how close I was last time. If I hadn't stopped to recover my stamina, probably would have been fine. There we go. Probably my favorite transformation. There we go. Uh, we got a warp. Got it. Alright. Through the other side. 
We're looking for more transformations, my man. Uh, we can move that with frog form, which is right here. Love frog form. No double jump. Man, his tongue is long. Can you imagine how much that would actually hurt? Swing around by your tongue. There we go. Boop. Frogman unlocked. Now, the hardest one out of all of these, I think, is probably Pigman. You'll see when we get there. Yeah, we'll get there, too. Uh... Oh, right. Like, wait a second, that doesn't make any sense. It does, because now we have these open. Hey, it's Dragon Man. Whoa! And yes, I call all the forms Man. And I don't think they're actually called Man in this game. But in Wonder Boy 3, they are all called Man. Alright, into Dragon Man. And of course, for Dragon Man, we get the side scroller. The side scrolling shmup. Whole lot of fun. Oop. No, come on. Gotcha. Gotta get them all. Oop. Go, go, go. I don't remember if there's a boss here. I don't think there's a boss here. Ow. Uh, I missed one. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jump. These are the exact same knights that we fought before. So, hit their heads. Whoa! Fortunately, collision detection, apparently, not too bad on this. Because, of course, if I screw this up, I'm going all the way back. Okay, now this should be easier. This should be a charge? Yeah. There we go. Two knights counts as a boss. Sure, why not? And Dragon Man is unlocked. And of course, with Dragon Man, the world is our oyster, right? Now we can fly. Uh, is this open? This is open. Oh, yeah, now we're only missing pig. Nope. Oh. There we go. Okay, so... 
First things first, I'll head this way. Whoa. Um. Ow. I think I went through that like a dummy. I don't think I was supposed to go through that way. Okay, so I did miss some chests back there. Gold weapon parts. Collect them all. Get them to a talented blacksmith to create the ultimate weapon. Oh. Okay, so we need the golden armor, I believe, and the golden weapon. You'll see these two spots here where it's telling me, hey, dummy, here's where you need to go to get the armor part is in the uh, temple there and the sword part in the lighthouse. They say, okay, we can get these pieces. And I think we got enough time that we should be able to go get them now. Yeah, we need uh, at least the weapon to go get Pigman, so we should do that. So the last time I came to the lighthouse, I totally neglected to go up. I should have, but I didn't. Uh, I need the mirror shield. Uh, maybe I gotta turn this. Yeah, there we go. And I think I might have to turn this here, too. And then turn it back this way. Crank that one. Mm. Push this over the edge. I think that's gonna be better. Ah! Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. It's not shooting the right way. Ah! Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall! Crap. I don't remember having much of a problem with this one, either. Of course, now I'm having a problem with it. Not terribly surprising, considering. Oh, hey, I can actually reflect it that way. That's what I should be doing. Um... It just seems wrong. 
There we go. That's correct. Alright, that should be our last gold weapon part. Yep. Bring all five parts. Whoop. Normally I wouldn't, but I can fly right back up for no problem. Okay, we got one more. The golden armor part. We're not going to uh, waste it and do both here. Like, do one and then go to the forge and then do the other and go to the forge. That's a waste of our time. Mm, get closer. So the tough part here for me is going to be remembering where this is. I feel like it's over. Like I said, remembering where this is is going to be the hard part for me. Oh! Ah! There's a pig spot right here. And I can't actually get that right now. Okay, time to time to warp. We'll come back. I don't remember if I need the big spot or not, but we should get Big Man while we're at it. Okay, so if we take all five of our golden pieces, we can bring them in here and forge the golden sword, the best weapon in the kingdom. Its mighty element and razor sharp edges allow the wielder to cut through dark matter. And then we can use our golden gems to upgrade our golden equipment. In this case, plus our 50% chance to critical hit, which is pretty good. And because it cuts through dark matter, we can head back over to here and finally get Pigman. Um, yeah, that's fine. We're going to switch over to the Golden Sword. Which you'll notice has three attack. So the most attack you can get. Ooh, we got the crit, which is nice. Um, let's see here. That. Now I switch to dragon. There we go. Now we switch to frog. Oh, I don't have pig. Once again, need that pig man. Woo! Let's not go into the skulls. 
But we can now warp back this way. And take care of this. Goodbye, Dark Matter. Ow. Well, that sucked. All right, back to Lion Man. Dragon Man, Frog Man. Grab a potion. Like, we're loaded, we should be grabbing potions. Okay, off to Man Man. I believe they called it Q Man back in the, uh, back in Wonder Boy. And into Pig Man. Um, oh, I'm going to need. Oh. Ah! Well, that sucked. Come on, man, come for me. I don't think he's coming. Oh. No! Uh, let's try fireballs. But this guy spits fire, so I don't know how well that's gonna work. Pretty well, apparently. Now we can sniff out the next paths to go. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Crap. There it is. No! Oh, this game. This game. Such a great game, honestly. There are parts like this that are rather tricky. Oh, you see the lightning in the ceiling. And then the fire in the ceiling. Okay. Hopefully we've lined these up well enough. Whoa! All right, invisible object there. No crap. I just totally screwed that up. And that's not a solid platform. There we go. Got it. Whoa! Hmm. 
Make sure we're not missing anything. Excellent. Whew. Pigman unlocked. It's a pain in the butt, Pigman. You're not worth it. Uh, I need human. Dragon Man. There are a couple of chests in this room, I believe. One is right here, and we should be able to get that now. Uh, oh, wait, wait. That was actually the way I wanted. Let's... Okay, so, we got Pigman here. I do not remember what I'm supposed to do here. Like, I'm pretty positive this needs a thing. Whoa, don't do that. Looks like the thing is probably fire. Not there. This one needs to go over that guy. And this one needs to go over the last one, I think. Nope. Middle one? Yeah, I think so. Like, that's definitely there. That one is definitely there. Hmm. But, what about the last one? I think I have to write this down. To the writing utensil. Alright, so I have... Four is... Tornado. Five is lightning. Six is bomb. Nope. I want you the other way. Hmm. 
<laughs> I don't know what the top one is here. We got uh, this. Seven is lightning. No, this one doesn't make any sense. Okay, we're gonna hit this. No, this guy. That doesn't make any sense either. Uh, what do we get here? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense right there. We got one is fire, two is fire, three is tornado. Now we just need the last one. That does not actually make sense. Nope, that doesn't make any sense either. No, I want you. Let's bring in you. That doesn't make any sense to me. I'm gonna move this. And hit this guy. Seven, eight, nine, that makes more sense. Seven is lightning. Eight is bomb. And nine is lightning. This chest isn't gonna be worth it. I feel very strongly about that, but. Okay, fire, fire, tornado, that's three. Tornado is four. Lightning is five. Bomb is six. So, lightning and bomb and lightning. Lightning. Bomb. Lightning. Okay, that was worth it. Golden gems were worth it. Most priceless gems of all. Upgrade your gear. Okay, that was a bit of a pain in the butt, but if you were stuck on that one, there's the answer. It also how we get the answer. I uh, don't need you because I got one. Whoa. Maybe I do need you. Ow. Oh, come on. Wait, where am I? That's weird that they put me all the way back at the beginning of the gate. What's this door? Oh! All the way back at the sanctuary, even. Okay, so we're gonna teleport super quick.
head back here, use the pig man. You know, I've never actually used the uh, teleport staff as a weapon. I don't actually know if it's good or terrible or what. Ah, uh, that's a power gem, which is not what I was looking for. Well, this is unfortunate. I thought I was dead for a second. What am I missing? Like, clearly I'm missing something. Oh! I'm an idiot. That's what I'm missing. You know, it's not uncommon that I'm an idiot. It happens. I'm missing this door. And we're gonna switch this to the Golden Sword. And this is actually really neat, right? Because this is a portal. So, we can toggle portals on and off. Like, right now we have death down there, so we'll toggle the portal on. Get over to the other side. I don't know why I would turn the portal off there. Uh, I actually need the portal off. Or... There we go. Alright, snake man. We portal around as a snake. Um, yeah, we do want down there eventually, because we see the chest. But not at the moment, we gotta flip this thing first. Gotta flip the script. So we pop up into here. Do the frogman. Do the frogman. There we go. That should be exactly what we need. Forge golden armor. Bring your armor to Maximus. Okay. Easy enough. Ah, oh, you gotta be outside first. There we go. Okay, and we're gonna forge the golden armor and then we're gonna be done for the day. Actually, we're not quite done. We're almost done. 
Great. We forged the golden armor. Again, every armor piece costs a thousand, so money is kind of important. The best armor in the kingdom. The strong, lustrous surface gleams in the dark and resists dark energy. 100% shine. Very bright. Invisible to Dark Realm Guardian. So the guy who uh, follows you around behind those crystals, he's fine now. And then one golden gem to get you immune to status change. Which is also pretty valuable. And max defense. There you go, we got max speed, max defense, max attack, extra critical damage. Now the one thing we are going to do before we're done is we are going to trade in our loot master stuff. Which is here in the village area. We go to the loot master. And this is what we'll be doing next time. How many would you like to spend? We will spend 20. Now he's going to pop 20 chests onto the map for us. And here we can see all the chests that we've missed. There's not a small amount. Is that it? That might be it. Was that 20? That didn't feel like 20. Can we spend eight more? Are there eight more? Couple in the last place there. Which I knew there would be. There we go. So we have quite a few chests to get. And next time, we will be going ahead to grab lots of chests. I think that is uh, on the menu here. So I could probably grab that one really quick. Let's grab that one super quick. It's just over two rooms from here. So you say, why didn't I get this one before? Oh, because it was an invisible wall. Uh... You have a boomerang for me? No, of course not. Magic shop nearby? No, of course not. Well, there's a magic shop in town. Let's see if we can teleport back without resetting everything. Whoa. Like it's possible. And of course, you can buy more rainbow drops, if you want. But I'm not looking for more rainbow drops today. Like, I think, I think 28 is enough for the time being. Gimme. We're gonna need that money. No! Well, I guess I can't get this one right now. I'm gonna need another another boomerang. Is there one I can get right now? Just look for anything that's close to a portal. Actually, that one right down there is super close to a portal.
I just want a chest before I end. There we go. Ooh, a legendary gem. Not bad. Not bad at all. See what I mean, though? It's, it's totally addicting to get in here and just start wanting these chests, you know? Did I miss the door in here? Really? I missed the door. There we go. Watch that be a uh, boomerang. Oh my gosh, it could be a boomerang. Oh no, okay, it's tornado. And that's every tornado. So, I mean, 94.9% .9 map exploration. You can see on the chests and upgrades that we are not at 94%. We've got, like, 70%, 58% on the hearts. Like, uh, those, those aren't so great. Golden bracelets, we're not doing so great. But we will get there. It looks like we missed a couple of chests in uh, the haunted house. So we will, of course, go back and get those couple of chests over here and over here this is this is great and over here it looks like we missed a door uh and we got yeah there's so many there's so much stuff around i love it okay next time chest extravaganza if you enjoyed this video go ahead and hit that like button if you want to see more monster boy in the cursed kingdom feel free to subscribe plus it helps out the channel quite a bit thank you so much for watching take care i'll see you next time